What's up guys, Shahbaz here. So this is really bad news. According to the latest news, the new Galaxy S24 is unified to Exynos 2400 and no Snapdragon. It is unclear whether the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 for Galaxy is installed or whether the SoC is unified with the Snapdragon unlike before. But the performance of the Samsung Galaxy S23 line is stable and above all, the battery life is also greatly improved. High-end models in recent years have had unstable battery life. But the Galaxy S23 series is pretty good. Personally, I wanted this trend to continue next year. But according to this information, the Galaxy S24 line that will appear next year may, on the contrary, only have Exynos 2400 equipped models. Now, Giz China reports that the Galaxy S24 may not use Snapdragon, so I would like to summarize it briefly. According to some information, the Exynos 2300 was not adopted in the Galaxy S23 lineup due to its low performance. In this situation, can Exynos 2400 develop an SoC that achieves performance exceeding Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 processor? Another source predicted that the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 will come in three models, one of which will be exclusively to the Galaxy. I don't know how credible this information is, but I personally feel like Exynos should stop unifying. According to another source, the Samsung Galaxy S24 could get more power under the hood, as well as RAM upgrades. Sources claims that next year Samsung Galaxy S24 and Galaxy S24 Plus could feature 12GB of RAM as standard. Currently, only the Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra gets 12GB of RAM. It is also reported that the Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra could pack as much as 16GB of RAM next year, making it the first Samsung smartphone to do so. Additionally, the Samsung Galaxy S24 and Galaxy S24 Plus could feature 256GB as a base storage option. Next year, Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra could feature an upgraded display with a refresh rate of up to 144Hz. According to the publication Sam Lover, this would be the first time a Samsung smartphone features a 144Hz display, as 120Hz has been the ceiling for Samsung devices so far. Additionally, it is reported that it could feature a UFS 4.1 massive storage option. The new Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra is expected to have a 6.8 inches dynamic AMOLED screen like the previous generation and a quad HD plus resolution. According to the news, the new Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra smartphone has an amazing camera and other exciting features. It is expected that the new Galaxy S24 line will officially launch early next year. That's it for now. For more updates, please subscribe to our channel Science and Knowledge. Until the next video, take care of yourself very well. Peace out.